Hey guys, how's it going? I hope everyone's doing well. Guys, thank you so much for all this time and support. I really appreciate it. Guys, stick around for the entire video and let me know what your thoughts are. So guys, I want to go ahead and cover today's topic is feeling like you're worthless. Like you have nothing to offer. Like you don't have anything of value. And it's completely normal to feel this way. I felt this way. And many others have felt this way. And acknowledge the emotion. Acknowledge that it hurts, guys. Because I'll be honest with you, I can testify that acknowledging emotions when they're there has helped me tremendously over these past couple of years. And it's, you know, I wish I would have learned this at a very young age, but unfortunately I didn't, you know, I underestimated the importance of, of mental health and trying to help myself. You know, I wish I would have had that. I wish I would have treasured that when I was younger. But anyway, what I want to go ahead and say guys is that there, I was watching this video of this young gentleman saying, you know, he went to therapy, a therapy session with this therapist and the therapist was saying, you know, you know, that that homeless person that you see out there, you know, on, uh, you know, asking for money, you know, do they have something to offer? You know, are, are they worthless? No, they're not worthless. They have something to offer. What about the nurse at the hospital? Do they have something to offer? Of course, they have something to offer. And and the thing is. They, you know, made and made this gentleman think like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I know I don't, I'm not in dire straits maybe as this homeless person. So I do have something to offer. And the truth is sometimes guys, it, you know, even though our logic is sound when we're feeling bad, the truth is we're listening to thoughts that are just not going to help us. And the truth is sometimes your mind can be your best friend and sometimes it could be your worst enemy. Sometimes you just have to ignore your negativity you don't want to be in like i mentioned you know it's when you have these thoughts and you listen to them and you start believing them that's like being in an abusive relationship with yourself you know and that's not something you'd want right and that's you know and the truth is uh also i want to go ahead and say I remember, um speaking of worthless i felt that way for example uh you know there was a couple of years ago where i had a tech job and i got fired after three three weeks and I felt terrible and it was bad and I felt worthless man the whole 30 minutes going back home on that drive man that was quiet and sad I mean I just felt bummed out but you know after a time you know passed by and then I want I wanted to be in the IT field but I couldn't at the time so but you know what now I'm in healthcare and guess what I'm helping out people and it's made me feel uh, wonderful. And sometimes, you guys, um, seeing how people are trying to get mental health, it helped me out as well. So, guys, I'll be, you know, I, um, now that I'm in this job, it has helped my mental health a lot, just tremendously. So, I just want to go ahead and say that. And, you guys, there's so much things to be grateful for as well. Um I know that you're probably, you know, this video is about talking about being, feeling worthless, but you guys, you know, now that we're, now that the Thanksgiving, now that Thanksgiving isn't that far away, I think it's a good time to be very grateful for what you have. And, and I'm not trying to, you know, sound, you know, awful, but you know, if you live in the United States, you know, there's so many opportunities that you have that others don't. And there's others in countries that are that are in dire straits that would happily take your place. And the truth is, guys, you know, you have a lot to be grateful for, even though you feel worthless. You know, these are just negative thoughts at the time. You can't buy into them because they're just going to tear you apart. That's what I want to say, guys, in terms of feeling worthless, is to not give it too much thought and, you know, acknowledge your emotions and count your blessings.